Okay, the first thing you're going to want to do is find the PDF file to print with. Uh, for example, I'm going to use uh, the new Stratego uh, PDF file made by Vorticon for his new program on the TI-99 for a home computer. So once you go down and uh, find what you're looking for, in this case, you see the Stratego manual PDF, you just download the file. And once it's downloaded, just a matter of clicking on the, the manual PDF, uh, once the program is already loaded, and then you, it'll pop up. And when you hit the print button, it'll come up with a little screen. You want to select booklet. And then you can see here in the little uh, middle of the screen here, uh, as I'm clicking through, you can see what it's going to look like when it prints out. This program automatically adjusts the pages for you. It's, it's, it's easy to use. And then when you actually hit the print button, it'll send it to your printer. And uh, the program, if your printer uh, is set up for it, will automatically uh, print on both sides. Two pages on each side, so it saves a lot of paper to work this way too. Okay, we're almost done here. Alright. Once it's done printing, you just take it out of the printer naturally and move it over to your work desk where you can uh, staple it up. Now, if you don't have a big long stapler, you can always. Uh, open up a, a shorter stapler and uh, press it into a, a book or something and then uh, pull it out afterwards and manually fold over the staples. It's not as nice, but it works. Then you fold it over. And after you get that done, it's just a matter of uh, trimming it up. Now, if you don't have a, a big uh, cutter like this, you can use a, a ruler and an exacto knife and it will work just as well. So, now you see what the finished booklet looks like. All the pages are in the correct spot. The binder is done, staples are in. The whole thing from download to printing takes less than like three or four minutes. It's, it's uh, really easy to do. So now you guys can do one yourself. But of course you're going to need the proper program. And in this case you want to use Adobe Acrobat Reader DC. The URL is on the screen here. And so you just choose your operating system, the language uh, you're going to use, Download the program, and then at that point, it's just a matter of following the installation instructions. And you're all good to go, and you'll be able to make your own manuals too. Have fun!